My name is Mikkel Amin, AKA Mikkel The Energy. Um, I am a spiritual health coach and a world changer. My impetus for everything that I do for when it comes to creating, uh, when it comes to serving, when it comes to business or philanthropic practices, it doesn't matter. It's all about helping people create freedom for themselves. Helping people get back to the nature of their own spirit. You see, I love to make music. I love to dance. I love to travel and connect people. I love to uh, open people's minds to new perspectives. You know, I like to use everything that I have learned creatively to empower people. Uh, I created a spiritual health game called Cheza Rojo. And Cheza Rojo is Swahili word that means to play with spirit. And so one thing, I, again, in the, in the spirit of bringing people back to their own nature, what I did with the dancers today is about helping them get out of the box of dance. Dance can be a prison because it has rules. It is confined to an industry. There is a right way and there's a wrong way, you see? And when people's hearts go towards something like dance or music or acting or any other thing, when your hearts go to the performing arts, you go there to be free. You don't go there to be in prison. But you'll find that as you uh, submit your freedom of expression to this box called dance, you end up losing yourself, just trying to get by, wanting to become the next big dancer, or the next professional dancer. You wanna fit in, you wanna stand in line, you wanna make sure you're doing everything right, you know? And so Cheza Rojo is about helping people remind themselves of the essence of what dance is, which is rhythm, which is breathing, that's it. It was called Rebellious, it's called Crazy, and now look, jazz is your evening playlist in the Hilton Hotel. Does that make sense? That's how hip hop started, that's how grime started. That's where reggae comes from. That's where anything that we have a name for. Hip hop was not called hip hop. Grime was not called grime. You see, jazz is not called jazz. As soon as it got its name, then it started to have a defined trajectory. Then it started to move from the hands of the people that created it into those who wanted to learn it and others who wanted to abuse it and capitalize off of it. And so the same thing is going to continue and continue to happen. Um, for me, my mission is to help uh, people, particularly people of the African diaspora, because all these genres of music start from us. Every single one of them, jazz, rock and roll, R&B, soul, grime, techno, disco, you name them. They all come from the spiritual expressions of African people. 